Hi, what's up guys? I'm playing The Walking Dead again. We're going to be starting where we left off last time, so let's get right into the video. The people, on the other hand, they're not my favorite. Usually I'm in and out as quick as I can manage. It's just a pit stop, okay? We're gone as soon as there's a window. I hope that window comes soon. In the meantime... Hey, Javi. What's... what's up? My family... They're still out there. In the middle of all that. If you guys made it this long, I I'm sure you know... They'll know what to do. Hopefully. Let's go. This way. I gotta see a guy about some bullets. Jeez. I haven't been in a place like this since... Well... You know, it's just like the old days. Listen, I gotta take care of something. Hang tight. Well, wait, wait. Well, what should I do? I don't know. Why don't you make some friends? Excuse me. Oh, you again. <laughs> you got some moves, I'll give you that. Hold on a minute. Don't I know you from somewhere? I don't know. Maybe. Garcia. Javier Garcia. For what it's worth, I think you got screwed on the gambling thing. A lifetime ban. Shit. Should have had a 20-year career. The way I see it, nothing wrong with betting on yourself to win. Honestly, I don't even think about it anymore. Past is the past. Hmm. <laughs> Fair enough. Anyway, I'm Conrad. This here's Francine. He runs the place? I just take his money. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe I'm just letting you win. Oh, actually, if you're the gambling type, game's poker. Five card stud. I'll raise you. What do you think? Should I call or should I fold? Hmm. <laughs> don't get too intimidated. I lose more often than I care to admit. Though all it takes is one good hand. I don't really gamble anymore. Went all in on the wrong hand once. <laughs> it's okay, hon. I got this one. Raise. Moment of truth. Flip them. Oh my. Ain't that a pretty sight. Oh, hell yeah! Nice. Oh, calm down, both of you. Bottom it up. Wow, man, this smells like turpentine. <laughs> That's the weak stuff. Don't turn away from me. I'm talking to you. Oh, shit. Hey, what's the point in talking when I already told you a deal is a deal? And it's done. What's going on? This guy ripped me off. I traded him a crate of perfectly good batteries, and he gave me a box of bullets that won't fire! He could have gotten both of us killed! Oh yeah? And who the fuck are you, a bodyguard or something? Cause I don't scare easy, alright? She doesn't need a bodyguard. She can take care of herself. Believe me. Uh, well, you can't even prove those are the bullets I traded you. Oh, hey, Clem, come on. He knows the bullets don't work. Listen to him. He's not even nervous. I could have died because of his bullets. I'm fucking believable. Look out! Hey, listen. Let's all cool down, huh? You were acting crazy, I was too. We just got a little out of hand. That's all. Just give me what I'm owed. Jesus. You gotta get her under control, man. This ain't no way to do business. Boy, you have it wrong, buddy. I don't control her. Which looks like bad news for you. 
we had a deal. All right, hey, okay, all right, so, hey, we'll, we'll trade back. I'll find some batteries. I don't need batteries. What I need are bullets that won't get me killed. Oh. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. Drop the gun! Right now! Say he attacked you and that he was going for his gun. I fucking warned you! Eli attacked him. I only shot because... Shut it! You've done enough talking. Drop it. There's a herd out there, and you're firing off a fucking... What the fuck happened here? He attacked Javi, okay? It was self-defense. Enough from you. Did she really have to shoot? Look at my eye, man. Of course she's telling the truth. The guy ripped her off, reached for his gun, and would have shot me if she hadn't stopped him. See? You happy now? <sighs> God damn it. I'm putting you two under lock and key until I figure out what to do with Whoa. you. Oh, hey, what? Are you for real? As real as it gets. Now move it. Got some nerve coming in here fucking up my bar. I oughta punch your fucking lights out. Both of ya. But Eli was a grade-A certified dipshit. I'll even have someone come take a look at that cut. Hey. Thanks for having my back at the hangar. That was, um... That was cool of you. I wasn't sure there for a minute. Of course. Anytime. Hell, I mean, you and I are a team now. Thanks. I mean it. Just don't think this makes us friends or anything. Hello? I'm Eleanor. I'm what passes for a doctor around here. The trip sort of overdoes it sometimes. I hate that I'm treating you in a cage, like you're some feral animal. Javier, pleasure's all mine. Is it now? Now, let's see about that wound. Yeah, he got you good. Try to hold still. <clears throat> Why is it always the pretty ones who end up causing the most trouble? As if good looks equal bad behavior or something. <sighs> I've never understood it. Oh, I'm not a troublemaker. No, Trouble sees me and runs the other way. That explains why Trip locked you up for the night. People are saying she killed a man in cold blood. If you don't mind me asking, what did happen exactly? That they were arguing and that she went crazy over nothing? That guy had it coming. Believe me. Karma, justice, you call it whatever you want. But fuck that bastard. Hey, okay. If you say so. Best thing is probably for you two to leave town. And get back to your group. We were attacked earlier this evening. There were four of us. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. If there's... If there's anything I can do to help. Well, not that I have much to offer you, but... Hey, it's okay. You've done enough. I hear you, but... Eleanor? You done yet? Just about. All right, here's what we're gonna do. I'm driving you that junkyard myself. Get you out of my hair, and no one can say I didn't do right by no one. In the meantime, you two can sleep right here and think about what shitheads you were earlier. On my terms and on my timeline. You got me? All right, fair enough. Fair enough? Go kiss a skunk's ass. I should be earning a goddamn Boy Scout badge for this. Trip, it doesn't seem right to wait. Javi's people, they could need a medic. Nuh-uh, no way. Not putting you in that kind of danger again. That's not your call. Look, maybe there's another way. We've got a rear gate down at the other end of the airfield. We don't use it much, but... Well, we could leave tonight. 
Slip past the herd, get a jump start on reaching that junkyard? Something tells me Trip won't be too happy about you sneaking us out the back door. He'll get pissy, but he'll get over it. Sometimes with him, you gotta ask for forgiveness rather than permission. Anyway, think about it. I've got to check on some patients, but I'll be back in an hour. You know, I never would have guessed she had it in her. Yeah, she's... She's something. The thing is, is, and maybe this sounds weird, but I still trust Trip more than I trust her. You're right. Trip's got more muscle, just in case. We'll wait and get a ride with him. Glad you're finally listening to reason. You know, when I met you, I thought you'd just be another asshole like everyone else. And to think that when we first met, you nearly blew my head off. <laughs> yeah, guess I made the right call. It's gonna be a while before that herd passes. We might as well get some sleep. Good idea. I'm exhausted. I'll get the lamp. Jay. That's dinner. Aren't you hungry? <sighs> We're out of food, AJ. We're gonna starve. I'm starving. We gotta... AJ, stay here while I find us dinner, okay? Uh, tell me you understand. No. <sighs> Please, we need this, AJ. We need food. You gotta be brave, okay? Hey, Clem. We almost there. Hey, Clem. 
Yeah, we're close. I gotta say, I hope your people are safe and sound. Eleanor asked me before we left to make sure of it. Oh, yeah? Yes, sir. So that's what I'm gonna do. Though so why she went to bat for you, I've got no idea. I mean, she hardly even knows you. No, there's not much mystery to a trip. She's a good human being. Yeah. Eleanor's got a big heart. That's for damn sure. Guys, that's the place. Oh, shit. What a mess. Jesus. Must have been hundreds of them. Kate's good in a crisis. She'd know how to get shelter. What's that? Tape player. Mariana? Mariana, are you here? Javi! Oh my god! You're safe! I can't believe it! You told me where to hide. I just listened to what you said. Lock yourself in and don't come out, not even once it's quiet. It kept running through my head like on a loop. You did exactly what you should have done. I always knew you were a smart kid. Thanks. It was scary at first. But once the muertos couldn't see me anymore, they just passed by. Kate, and your brother, where are they? We got pulled apart when that huge bunch of muertos showed up. Kate yelled that they were gonna try to make it back to the van. Then that's where we're headed. Let's go find your brother, sweetheart. Oh no. No, no sign of them. They must have seen it like this, then gone someplace else to hide. Kate. They're trapped in there. Mariana, stay back. See me? I'm happy to see all of you. Happy you're all okay. Another couple of minutes, we might not have been. But then, you showed up. Just when it really mattered. Yeah, well, that's kind of my thing. Oh. <laughs> I, I wanted to come after you. I, I swear I did. You don't have to snot all over my shirt about it. I thought we were dead. Like, never gonna see you again, Dad. You're still alive, aren't you? So is Kate. So is Mari. That's all that matters. I was just so scared. I'm here now. You don't have to be scared. Hey, you hurt yourself. You must have scraped it in the truck. Didn't even notice. Hey, at least it's not a bite. Well, not much we can do about it here. I've got a lady friend who's a doctor. Soon as we get back to Prescott, she'll patch you right up. I'm Trip, by the way. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should be getting back. Don't want to push her luck. Who's the kid with the gun? She have a name you want to share with us? She saved my life. Pulled this crazy stunt. Let me get the upper hand on the asshole who took me away from you guys. Her name's Clementine. Hi, there. Glad I was able to help. Well, we're very grateful to you. Really. There's a town nearby. It's safe. I like the sound of that. Oh 
Oh my god. Javi, do they have hot water? Even like lukewarm water would be okay. Ugh, oh, and bubble bath. Wouldn't bubble bath be amazing? Eh, don't get your hopes up too high. It's a nice place, but it's not the Ritz. Well, whatever they've got, I'm sure it's gonna be great. Between you and me, these kinds of missions don't usually go so well. But you found every single one of your people. And you found them alive, healthy, reasonably cheerful. Well, let's wait to celebrate until we're back behind the walls, okay? I don't want to jinx us. Well, some things are worth saying woo-hoo about, that's all. When we get back to Prescott, you still owe me a working ride. I haven't forgotten about our deal. You couldn't have known what happened to your van, but still, I need some way out of here. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten our arrangement. I know it's not the easiest thing to find, but... Cool. Thanks. Jesus. Jesus, I'm so... She just... I know, Javi. And there'll be time for all that, but not right now. Kate needs a doctor. Which means we gotta go. We got a window here, man. We gotta get a move on before they start shooting again. I'm gonna fucking kill them. I'm gonna kill all of them. You wanna die too? You think that's gonna help your little girl? So what? I'm just supposed to let him live? If you want to do what's right for your family, you'll come with me. It's time to go, man. We stay here and we finish this. Are you fucking nuts? We gotta get the fuck out of here we right now! We already killed one of you. If we don't stop them, they're gonna come after your family again. Let Trip help them. You stay with me. What? N no, uh, Javi, you have to come with us. Javi, please! Trust me, Javi. We have to end this now. Get her back to Prescott. We'll cover you. Javi! Go with them. I'll be fine. Give me a hand here, kid. Just keep firing until they're out of sight, okay? I'm ready. Javi, don't! Alright guys, I'm in this video here. If you liked it, hit the like button, subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you in the next one.